Pop Tarts. Hey guys, what's happening? Welcome to the tutorial I have here on soul trapping. So this one, uh, it's very easy to do. Um, but first, we must start off with identification. So let's open up our 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 menu here. And we'll go into our miscellaneous tab, and we'll check out our soul gems. So here, uh, we definitely know this one does not have a soul in it, this common soul gem, because it displays that it's empty. And here, in this common soul gem, we captured a lesser soul in it. And so the importance of these gems is for enchanters which I recently did a tutorial on, so if you have not yet checked that one out, go ahead and look at that one, and you'll see the much relevance and importance of these soul gems. So, let's hop into this. Uh, first, you're going to need a, a weapon or a spell that does... Um, that can soul trap in your conjuration, it's under conjuration for your for your magic school, to soul trap. And so if the, let me read this to you, if the target dies within 60 seconds, it fills a soul gem. So like I have here in my inventory, we have an empty soul gem. We will fill this with that spell. So I'm going to demonstrate how this works. Um, I have my soul traps uh, equipped. And I have some crabs here that will make perfect for filling up these uh, soul gems. Now, I am unaware of whether or not uh, the quality or the size of the of the soul being trapped is determined by your level of conjuration or the level of the enemy. Um, so, as you can tell, there are different types of levels, such as the Grand Soul Gem, and there's different souls. There's a Grand Soul, Lesser Soul, Common Soul, and, or, you know, I, I, I don't know all of them off the top of my head, but that's how it works. So first, you want to equip your, your Soul Trap spell, and you want to cast it on an enemy. So I'll cast it on, I guess, this guy, because he's... It's getting aggressive with me. So now he's kind of purple. You see that purpliness to him? And I'm going to take out my sword and I'm going to uh, screw this crap up. And then bam! See that? Soul, soul captured. Let's do it to this guy too. He's not looking too happy with me. Blow him up. And I guess I didn't get one from him. It's just, it's just too much. So now, uh, let's look at our miscellaneous option again, and the gem that I just showed you that was empty is now filled with a soul, uh, and we can use this, or actually I think it might be this one, anyway, this soul uh, will allow us to enchant our, our items and armor uh, at the arcane enchanters table. So, uh, soul trapping is a very good way of uh, getting those souls into your gems. And I guess that's all I have for this tutorial. Uh, tune in for some more, and that's it. 